I think they're gonna offer below. If one of you guys gets this price right on the dot, I will give you my car. All right, so we got an offer or what? We got an offer. Yo, what is up guys? Before the video starts, I just want to inform you guys that I finally made a gaming channel. That's right, your boy is finally back to playing video games and filming them and uploading them to YouTube, but I did make a second channel for it. So for all my gaming fans, go hit that subscribe button. Link is in the description and go show me some love. My first gaming video is going to be out this week. I'm going to be posting a lot of Call of Duty, Fortnite, and different games on there. So go show some support and I'm trying to hit 100,000 subs in a day. Now enjoy the video. Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. I hope you're all having a great day as always. And today we are going to be taking my Lamborghini Urus to different CarMax dealerships to see what they would offer for it. As you guys may know, I've had this car for like six months now. It's a beautiful Lamborghini SUV, the second ever Lambo SUV to ever exist. And it's pretty hard to get your hands on one. I actually had to pre-order it one year in advance and it's really, really hard to get your hands on. So I'm pretty hyped that I have this, but I really want to know how much car dealerships would offer for it so one of these bad boys runs for about two hundred and fifty thousand dollars so i want your guys's opinion as to what you think the car dealerships are going to offer and of course this idea was given to me by you guys after i went and took my diamond play button to different pawn shops to see what they would offer you guys all commented saying that i should take my new lambo to different carmax dealerships and get it appraised so that's what we're about to be doing guys i hope you all do enjoy and i just want to thank you guys so much for all the support on my recent video Videos. like you guys have actually been killing it so let's keep it up and let's get right into the video ah uh, my beautiful parents and my beautiful dog and our beautiful son how you guys doing look where he's look sitting <laughs> guys look at bosley look how he's looking at the camera oh god Aww. okay all right all right guys so i'm taking my car to carmax to see how much they would offer for it what do you guys think i want your opinion uh you want to go first if they even gonna do that for you why wouldn't they it's too 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 big <laughs> <laughs> okay i'll say this and if they give you that price the car is mine Ooh, oh, okay. Hey. I like that game. Okay, yeah. 199. 199,000? 199. That's a good guess. Yeah. Okay, lock that in. If one of you guys gets this price right on the dot, I will give you my car. Hey, yeah, that's, a that's the gambling. Okay, that's... I don't like it. <laughs> Let me do that. the calculation. No, 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 no. Okay. So you're going to CarMax uh -huh. and other places, whatever. But CarMax, you remember, when you trade your car, they're going to try to resell it and get, make money too. So yeah. I will go. Two hundred and five thousand dollars. Oh wow, that's not bad. Okay, yeah. who do you think is better, guess? I mean, they're within six thousand dollars, but I think I think they're gonna offer below two hundred thousand. I don't know. I mean, it's a brand new car. Literally, like this is the second Lambo SUV in the world. The first one was made for like the army. So this is like the first luxurious SUV, and like I don't know, it's a beautiful car. Only like they're very very limited as well. Super hard to get your hands on, like I was mentioning. So two hundred and five. Two hundred and five. Lot. Ninety nine. You guys watch out for my picture with my new Lambo soon on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are about to head over to the first CarMax. I hope you guys enjoy. All right, fellas. We are here at CarMax. Yeah. I also forgot to mention I called them before coming here and they said no matter what car it is, they said they never take Lambos or anything, but they can at least appraise it and give me an offer. So no matter what, we're going to walk out of here with an offer. So we will see what they have to offer. Hopefully it's like within the 200,000 range, but who knows? I actually never gave my guess yet. So if these cars are worth around 250,000, I've had it for about six months. There's 9,000 miles on it. I know I, I drive a lot to and from LA. I'm honestly gonna have to go with like 175,000. I think they're gonna lowball me at first because you know, I look like a kid. I look like I'm dumb. I look like I don't know anything about cars. So I mean, if I was them, I would do the same. So we're gonna go find out. Uh, we're gonna get it appraised and we'll see the offer. All right, man. Yeah, we're just trying to see what we could get for this bad boy. Okay, for sure, man. Have you guys ever gotten a Urus here? Never. Yeah? <laughs> Never. Yo, rice, what is up, You said rice? Oh my <laughs> is, it, is that rice? Like rice gum? 
<laughs> bro. I kind of look like rice gum. Low key, a little bit, Low yeah. Key. Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, go ahead and check out this Lamborghini here. I am not gonna do it because I don't have the authority to do that. But <laughs> hey, I respect that. Hey, thank you, bro. I appreciate it. No problem. It. David will take care of you. He's a good man right there. Thank you, bro. Man. Thank you. Do you know my name at least? Rug. Yes. You already know. The That's Rugrats. Good. You gotta represent the Rugrats. Yes. I, I just like, yo, you up. get nervous a little bit. I was like, yo, it's the Rugrats, bro. Bro, I get, I get called Banks a lot. I don't know how. I don't have tattoos all over my body. So what year is this? So this is 2018. You can check out like the mileage and stuff too. Is that what you guys need for the appraisal? No, I won't need the mileage. I just put everything in the system. Oh, okay. And then, yeah, the, the buyers will come out here and do all that. Oh, perfect, perfect. Damn, this CarMax is already showing so much love to me, guys. Hopefully, they'll show me love with the offer, too. <laughs> How long do appraisals usually take? It's like 30 to 45 minutes. Okay. Yeah. Not bad. Is it like... You're going to sell it, right? Maybe, if I get a good offer. Of course. Yeah, of course, bro. I mean, yeah. you got me with a good offer? That's what I'm saying, bro. Let's go, dude. Have you guys gotten any other Lambos here? Like, not just the SUV, but like a Huracan or a Ventador? I have not seen that before. Okay. So this should be interesting. Yeah, it should be fun. <laughs> So if you guys like buy my car, do you guys give me like cash or a check? Yeah, or, so it's called a bank draft. So it looks like a check, but you can't like cash it like a check. You just gotta put it into a checking account. Oh, okay. Yeah. So that's it. Cool, cool. And uh, we're gonna look at the mileage and the age, the vehicle history, the features and option packages, and then the overall condition of the car. And we make it really fast and easy. You can walk away today with payment in hand. You don't have to advertise your car online or even depreciation and your offer is good for seven days and we'll buy your car even if you don't buy ours. Let's go. I think we're going to get a really good <laughs> offer on this one because it's brand new, no yeah. problems, like none yeah. of that. I'm so curious to see what you guys are going to offer. For sure. Man. Cool, cool. Bad news guys, so we waited for about like 10, 15 minutes and then they told us that this car was too unique and that they've never seen anything like it. They are actually not able to give us a legitimate offer, which is understandable. So right now we're probably gonna try to find another place cause I don't think CarMax would be able to do something like this. We already tried calling two other ones. So we're gonna try to find like a high end luxury dealership that could at least give us an appraisal and see how much they would offer for this car. So we're sorry about that. I thought they were able to do it on the phone. They said that no matter what car it is we'll give you an offer but i guess i was just misinformed so hopefully we'll find another place and we'll pick up the vlog there okay guys we found a dealership and we called before and they said they'll for sure give us a legitimate offer on the urus so you guys already know dealerships they lowball us so we'll see what they have to offer hey guys i know you're waiting for some action i know you're waiting for some numbers i am too but this appraisal here is almost done and they're gonna give me a legitimate offer finally and then i think after this we're gonna take it to one more dealership to kind of compare the prices that they're gonna eat each offer and see who gave the better one. All right, guys, we were told to chill in the lounge. They got an offer for us, so I'm hoping it's something good. I'm kind of nervous. I don't know what they're gonna offer. Maybe like, I'm gonna guess 200,000. That's my guess. Yeah, we should be getting an offer soon. Yeah, we got a payment for you. Wait, you got it? Yeah, we oh. got um, 185, how does that sound? 185? Okay, that's not that's not bad, but I don't know, you, you looked at all the details. And yeah, everything I did, looked it up and everything, brother. 185. How's 200? I'll take that. I'm already hurting the story at that point, man. I 185? Can't. I can't. I'm sorry. It's all good. All right, we, we might come back. Mm -hmm. 185. That's not bad. All right. All right, for My sure. Hey. Just give me a call, man. All right, thank you, thank you. Thank you, man. All right, guys, so we got our first offer for $185,000. It's a pretty decent offer, I'm not gonna lie. I thought we were gonna get lowballed even more, but 185 is not bad. I just called another dealership, and they said they're willing to appraise the vehicle, so I'm hoping they could offer more. I just, I just wanna see how high they're gonna go. So we're about to take it to the next dealership, and comment down below right now what you think the next offer will be. All right, guys, we are getting the car looked at right now. Hopefully, we get a good offer for it. I think I have to show him how to put it in drive. He reversed it. <laughs> you know how to put it in drive? No, not once. I, so, I yeah, got that's it in reverse. reverse. It's actually on the steering wheel, the two paddles to the right. Okay. You just press it once. All right, there you go. That's it. Yeah, just take good care of her, okay? Or I'll try. All right, thank you. Yeah, guys, so they have to take it for a little test drive to make sure it's all good. What's up, dude? How are you? Good, how are you? Good, good, nice to meet nice you. To meet. Ooh, the Ace Family shirt? Uh -huh, nice, bro. Okay. Hell yeah. Okay, so there's a the start. Yeah, so you start it like that. All right, guys, we're gonna try to see if he can put it in drive, if he can figure it out. All right, so that's reverse. That's reverse. <laughs> All right, let's see. I don't think you're gonna figure it out. So there's Ego, Daniel. Let's see. I can give you a hint. 
It's not like a swipe, is it's it? It's not no? on there. Oh shoot, it's not on here, okay. Okay. There you go, you Paddle got shifter. it. Okay, that's, Paddle shifter. Paddle yeah. Self-explain. Okay, manual. Okay. There you go. Okay, cool. And then park is the P right there. Okay. There you go. Cool. All right, so we got an offer or what? We got an offer. Ooh, okay. All right, brand new model. I get it. You put a lot of miles on that car. I did put a lot of pretty, miles. Pretty quick. Um, you know, I don't blame you. That's uh -huh. what, you know, that's what numbers are for. Yeah. Um, uh, the offer I got was 200. 200? Yeah. It's a, uh, you know, it, it is a pre-owned car, got some miles, a little higher than what typical Lambos have. We looked yeah. around online, a lot of them have about 2,000, 1,500. <laughs> oh, man. I saw one with 4,000 miles. Yeah. Yours is by far the highest, which is fine, uh, but I'll we'll give you a firm offer of 200,000. 200. That's not bad. The last dealership I went to offered 185. Really? So, okay. this is already like better. Okay. 200 is not bad. I actually asked my mom what she thinks that you guys would offer. She said 199. So, wow. a thousand Mom's more. Good. Yeah, right? <laughs> my dad said 205, so it's kind of like in between. Okay. So, I mean, if we do 205. 205. You're going to you're going to kill me over $5,000. <laughs> you're going to embarrass me over 5,000. No, honestly, you know? I, I'm going to have to say like 200 is a good offer. Yeah. It's pretty okay. Good. Um sounds good. Take it off my hands. Let's go. I'm just kidding. Wait, wait. wait. All right, guys, I am back home and we got two offers out of the three places we took it to. The first one was $185,000. Second one was $200,000. And my parents' guesses were $199,000 and $205,000. So it was honestly in between there. My guess, I think, was $200,000 as well. So honestly, I think they offered like a decent amount, but I still think the car is worth way more than what they offered. But I think that's their job. Like they obviously have to still make money on it, but I just thought it would be pretty pretty interesting taking it to all these places and seeing what they would have to offer for the one and only the rare Lamborghini Urus so hopefully that answered your guys questions as well I hope you all did enjoy remember guys I opened up my gaming channel phase rug games the link is in the description let's try to hit a hundred thousand subs in a day to all my gaming fans for everyone asking for gaming videos it's finally here I'm gonna be uploading Call of Duty Fortnite all of these fun games maybe even new games just like me gaming if you enjoy that go hit that subscribe button get me to a 100k i hope you guys all have a great rest of your day and other than that it's been rug and i'm out peace